We've got the Marauder bots flying down the laneway. They're going for a hatch on the rocket. It's a bold move. Jack down vectors place one on the cargo ship for the red. While Grayling goes to the corner for another hatch. Code Blue pulls five in that sandstorm. And it seems that's going to give this Blue Alliance a 28 to 21 lead. 61 20s deep in the corner, those Cyber Stings. They grip that hatch panel. Well, 61 21. The Grayling Robo Vikes. Ah, try to play a cargo. I don't know if that's scored or not. 61 21 with another three pointer for this Blue Alliance. Closes the gap with the red. And now they pass them. It's neck and neck. It's 26 11. Jacktown Vectors tussle with Code Blue in their drive to the rocket. They finally get there. That 3458 robot has them pinned for sure. Meanwhile, their partner, the Marauder Bots, try to go with a hatch panel top shelf. We've got 6120 on the far side. Blue Alliance going low on the rocket. It's good for two. They place it easy. Wow, 3458. Code Blue pressures the zone on Jacktown Vectors 2611. But they slide by with ease. That Ford robot from Ovid LC High School places a hatch on the Red Alliance rocket with 33 to go. This Red Alliance leads by two. And it's really all up in the air as to who's gonna come out on top. Jacktown Vectors with another cargo. They pop it out and go for the level three climb. Code Blue making their way over to this Blue Alliance. Looks like they're gonna go for the level one. And Jacktown's good with five to go. Three, two, one, zero. Let's take a look at our scores. The Red Alliance wins it. 79 to 68, keeping Jacktown Vectors up in the fifth spot.